Hi everyone, Sasha here with Lucent Graphic Solution. In this tutorial, I'm going to walk you through how to get started with vehicle templates and wrap design in Adobe Illustrator. I already have a vehicle template open. Right now, it's at a 1 to 20 scale. Personally, I prefer designing at 10% scale because it makes measurements easier. To scale it up, select everything, go to Object R Transform, Scale, enter 200% and hit OK. At 10% scale, measurements are much simpler. For example, if I draw a rectangle on the side of the van and it shows 4.4 by 4.3, just move the decimal one place over. That tells me it's actually 44 by 43 inches at full size. So if a client requests a 24 by 24 inch logo, I just set the rectangle to 2.4 by 2.4 inches in Illustrator. And that shows me exactly how it will look on the van. Next, I clean up the template by removing any extra text, unless you want to show it to a client for reference. Now let's set up layers for organization. Template layer, on top, background layer for wrap artwork, text and logos layer for branding elements. Keeping the template on top is important, so you don't accidentally place designs behind handles, emblems, or license plates. I'm switching to the group selection tool. This lets me grab entire grouped shapes, like the white vehicle panels. I'll copy those, remove the fills from the template layer, then paste the shapes into the background layer. This becomes my clipping mask for the wrap artwork. Now I'll bring in a background design. I paste it into the background layer, arrange it to the back, and then make a clipping mask with the vehicle outline. Boom! The artwork now fits perfectly within the van shape. Next, I unlock my text and logos layer and bring in the LGS logo. Keeping text and logos on a separate layer makes editing and repositioning much easier without disturbing the background design. For example, if I select all objects on this layer, it won't interfere with the wrap artwork. As I design further, I want elements to flow around the vehicle. For instance, I'll extend this blue pattern around the rear, or add pink accents on top. Using clipping masks again ensures everything stays neatly within the vehicle outline. And that's the foundation for creating a vehicle wrap design in Illustrator scaling, organizing layers, setting up clipping masks, and starting your layout. In the next tutorial, I'll cover how to panel out your design for print production. Make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and stay tuned.